What is up guys, Chu here, bringing you a different kind of video, but this time on Shiogeki no Soma. And boy, does it always feel good to talk about one of the most, be most beloved series. One of the ones that I have found the most friends in. And I'll probably even talk about that in a different video, but I gotta say, I have enjoyed Shiogeki no Soma. The chapter comes out in about a week, maybe a little less, but... I did want to do a prediction video. Uh, actually, I wanted to do it much earlier than this. But better late than never, you know. And honestly, this is the, probably the last time I'll be able to do something like this for this series. I've loved it so much. And, you know, it's sad for it to end. And this time, end for real. And it just sucks. But I do want to make a theory as to what I think is going to happen for the next chapter. And I also want to include uh, another person's theory, uh, Hyori-chan, a fellow subscriber of mine and a friend, uh, who has also kind of agreed with me. We kind of coincide with what I, what, what most of us believe is going to happen for the next chapter, or for at least what we hope for this chapter to happen. But just to kind of give you a quick recap as to what has happened, uh, previously in the last chapter, we finally had um the whole story of soma's mother uh not everything we don't see how she dies which is okay uh, i think that we can kind of do away with that we didn't have any soma in this chapter which is a big issue for me and a lot of people in the community and we also got to see uh sahi being a zombie's kid you know that was something i feel like it was very convenient a bit unnecessary and edina realizing she has a brother so that's kind of how it is um, Edina's haircut has honestly bothered me, and this bothered me since uh, a chapter ago. Not this chapter, I think. I think we believed the chapter before that when we first saw the haircut, and it's been bothering me ever since. But for this chapter, um, I do believe that there is going to be a time skip, at least not for the beginning half. I think that'll be probably towards the second half of the chapter. Uh, we'll see the Soma finally returning uh, this is what i hope you know home soma finally returning home after pulling a uh Jirichiro and just being away for so long uh they will graduate i hope we don't spend that much time on the graduation portion though i don't really want to see them you know taking too much time too many panels with graduation i just kind of want them to kind of go ahead and get over with it and move on from there i'd love to see you know what everyone is doing you know like them as adults now you know maybe a five you know or or even right after the chapter you know right after excuse me the um the graduation what some of their plans are you know just talking about what they plan on doing that would be fine with me you know i'd be okay with them you know just talking about what their plans are for the future and then we get to see you know a time skip and or you know not that this would ever happen but this would be a very lovely thing in my opinion that during graduation once soma has gotten his diploma along with everyone else he grabs edina and just kisses her right there in the stage or wherever they're at just to kind of shock everybody and that would be perfect i think that would be great but i don't think that would ever happen but i do like would like to see you know after the graduation you know time some time passes uh, not too much you know uh, hopefully you know about five six seven years you know that would be fine i think that'd be a reasonable amount they would probably be around my age at this point and uh, they would you know start you know seeing what they were doing I, and a lot of people already want some official couples going on now none of the couples that we've seen or none of the shipping that we've seen so far in uh, shogeki has been official I think it's going to be saved up for this very end. And maybe maybe it's just going to allude to a lot of things. That is something that a lot of people are probably afraid of. And I'm one of them. I'm afraid that we're just going to get, you know, a little tease of that. But a lot of us just want to see their kids. I don't want to see a kind of a Baruto thing. I will, I've actually talked about this before with my friends, uh, which I've done streams with before. Uh, Jay Sword and Juanse, they both have talked about, we've all talked about, you know, our thoughts on this. And... I would love to see, you know, them having children. That would be great. I think that would be something that gives us hope to maybe, maybe pull a bar with a route. But I don't want that to happen. Honestly, if the series ends with them all having kids, that's great. You know, that's great. But I don't want to 
seeing the same old thing, you know, just kids uh, going up against each other, and, you know, it's just, no, nah, I don't want to see that, I want to see something where it has a good ending, and that's just a, that's been a major, major problem with Shoviki, like, uh, when the actual series ended, what the, when the actual last chapter was given, not, not the epilogue chapter, not these Le Desert chapters, but, like, it just kind of ended badly, you know, it just left a big sour taste for a everyone i don't i don't really think there was anyone that was truly happy with the way that ended and so there's a lot riding on this chapter i honestly hope that if they do close it out that it's going to be good you know i don't want there to continue to be you know people that you know have all kinds of expressions i don't want them to just you know look at it and be in complete shock and anger with the fact that you know the series has finally ended i you know that well i feel like that'll happen with some people but I know that others will maybe like the way it ends. And some people will probably just be in tears in the fact that it's ended. Maybe the, the last chapter's a closing, like a, a very sweet and good closure to it. And that, that would be okay, you know. I would be fine with, you know, a little bit of tear reaction, you know, something like that. But I don't want it to be a very sad chapter. I want it to be a good chapter where i'm actually enjoying to read it because you know when i when the chapter comes out i will be live reacting to it you know that i don't want my face to end up you know just kind of being like okay this is it you know i don't i don't want it to be oh finally it's over you know like i i don't want to end a series that i've loved and have invested so much time in to just end very bitter you know so i hope that with the way this last chapter goes we get to see some couples getting together i'd love to see you know who gets with who i don't want to say aldini gets with megumi and uh, meet me or nikumi gets with uh, the other aldini brother I, I don't know i honestly it would be nice to see just a good way of ending it but the, i guess the biggest thing that everyone wants to see you know couple wise is so many you know that would be nice to see i would love to, for it to end that way and then to end it in a Great, I was gonna say a great way, in a great way. Excuse me. I hope the ends very, you know, very nice, and you know, no teases for anything else. You know, just end it properly. I, whether it be in a restaurant or at school and at home, just something nice. You know, that would be great. But guys, let me know what you guys think. What are your thoughts? What would you like to see in the end, the last chapter? As always, guys, stay safe, take care of yourselves and others, and I'll catch you. ゆきひらくん着眼点はまあまあ良かったのではなくてそうまくんなら今お手洗いに<笑><笑>